Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Divinity, Dragon Commander. I am the dragon half of the commander, the alchemical rabbit. Am I the commander portion of the commander? No, you... Well, I guess so, actually, yes. I was going to say you're the human, but if I'm the dragon half of the dragon commander, you are the commander portion. Okay. That raises a few questions. But we head in <laughs> to the strategy map. We've acquired a transport. Thanks. I know how those work. That was weird. It was. Okay, now the problem is, is they're somewhat barricading us. To this end, I am going to take... Let's see, what's on this island? We have another transport and a few troopers. I'd actually like to go ahead and load that onto the transport along with two of the grenadiers. Okay. And I'm actually going to take said transport to this island. Okay. Because there's currently uh, nothing holding it, and it's worth six gold. Okay. Uh, sh should you disembark? Yeah, I'm going to. I'm okay. just speaking to it all. Okay. So we'll claim that. That will get us another factory. Cool. Uh, which gives us, which we don't really have the money for it right now, admittedly. But So I'm going to go ahead and maybe do... So here's the question. We could spread our army out quickly mm -hmm. claim resources right and build something up the problem is that's going to spread our army out really thin yeah and we might get picked off i don't think we should do that i think we should mm -hmm. probably hunk like hunker down a little bit uh -huh. and and get like the areas that we're sur surrounding right now yes and then build up an army after that okay, so i'm building some transports there okay uh or some troopers I'm going to go ahead and spread these out because I have a bunch. Okay. Do like half of them. Yeah, so I'm going to move like half here and here. Okay. We're going to... I could move in on these troopers, but since he has a force here that could reinforce really yeah, easily... Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea yet. Yeah. Do I have any cards? No. Also, I need to wait for cards. Yeah. Um, I am going to go ahead and build a tavern. Okay. Just because I kind of feel like we need that okay um on this island we are going we're going to spend some time building okay that's fine we're going to, go ahead and build an academy okay since academy on this high research area feels like a good idea yes um over here i am going to go ahead and build i think a parliament yes would be good yeah and that that currently covers all of our territories okay all right back over here we have a decent amount of land units i'm gonna go ahead and build a couple of transports okay because i gotta keep moving stuff i'm gonna build one okay and then i am going to start going hunter heavy okay uh that's currently all i have the money for i'm going to go hunter and three more troopers okay that sounds good troopers for the defense yes yeah, for whenever he eventually moves his guys down or something. Yeah, because right now, it's weird. He's been building up this huge force, right? Yeah. Ten grenadiers, eight troopers, a lot of devastators, and a few hunters. Yeah, but he has no transport. He has no transport. He could build one at any moment, though. Yeah, I know. And if he does that, That's then scary. we're going to have to be ready. The armors will help. Good. Okay. I'm tempted... To take that... To move, take this elven land, because it's not really close to... Well, no, he can't invade quickly. Okay. So what I think I'm going to do is come over here and claim it. Okay. If that makes sense. Yep. This is only worth one in one. I don't really want to spread my forces out for that. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah, with this, we're, we're getting a decent hold. Yeah. On what we're looking for. Um, yeah, we'll stay here for right now. This transport is going to return here. Okay. Uh, so next turn it can come back home. Okay. Alright, he's starting to move fleets around. The other thing is if I can if I can eventually just isolate him on this island. Yeah, that'd be nice. Indeed. Also, let the green and the red fight in the water for a little while. Yeah, I'm mean, gonna let them sort of fight over this territory because now that they're running into each other, they might start to poke each other. Right. I'm gonna still defend this area. Yeah, that's a good idea. So that it doesn't come across. Cool. 
Okay, do we actually have... We do have some fights. That yellow and green is going to fight. Yellow and fight are going to green. I, yellow and what? Yellow and green are going to fight. <laughs> That's what I said. All right, green lost. Yep. All right, no other battles. Queen consults Imp Shaman. York enraged. It's not medicine. It's medicine. Get it? Queen kills kinsmen with imp tea. Stick to beer and mishaps like this won't happen, Sir Falstaff alleges. Moral mistrust in Maxis returns. Introduces Emperor to chemical warfare. Cult of crazies lavished with leniency. They deserve death, not diplomacy, claims outraged York. Man, York really just hates us. Yeah. <laughs> Psychologists say charm is a dragon's euphemism for fear euphemism that's what i said isn't it uh. no rest for the wicked emperor disagrees all right so that, that that's a really useful card bam that helps us build the force right at the beginning nice thank you ophelia yes uh may i help you prosper i've been meaning to thank you commander for acting upon catherine's request my new wedges please me in more ways than one. She has a knack for such issues, and though she's rather bellicose in expressing them, I hope you'll heed them all the same. Ah, you're welcome. By the seven, such heresy that Hellcat of a Catherine spouts. Championing the right of our women to vote is sacrilege, pure and simple. They'd beat her and put her behind bars where I come from. Well, thankfully, she ain't from where you're from. Just a little while ago, Commander, you broke a lance for women aboard this ship. And now I need you to break another of a far more serious, shocking, and I fear resilient kind. Okay. I'm talking of an injustice that could only have gone by unhindered in a land under the greasy thumb of a man as oblivious to the plight of his mothers, sisters, and lovers as the worm is to the vast world around it. It is my fondest hope that you shall prove to be a worm, not a worm by uprooting one of the many, but perhaps most glaring crimes against womankind that is institutionalized among the undead. A blight upon Rivalon. That is their ill-called civilization, led by old farts, dry of bone and dry of spirit, that say females must be subservient because the divines decree it so. Rot. They put whatever words will secure their pathetic hold to despotic hegemony in the Seven's mouths. But the vote, Commander, can change everything. Undead women can be candidates for government, but they themselves aren't allowed to vote, and therefore never get elected. You, then, shall either undo this gross travesty, this ignominious perversion, or by refusal admit you two are nothing but a barren weed, afraid to be plucked ridiculed and cast aside by willful women just like those skeletal cowards oh catherine why do you make the undead hate me <laughs> i mean really it, it, the moral choice is easy on this the only thing i can really play devil's advocate on is is it really the place of dragons and humans to change the culture of the undead no but they also shouldn't be dicks to their women the women will They don't have... even have dicks! That's their problem! They don't even have dicks to be dicks with! They have dildos. There's no dickenings! No, there's- they But have... there's no vaginas! They, do, they just like, I don't know, clank each other's- Pelvis? No, well, no, I was gonna say they like, xylophone their chests. Oh, I was gonna say, do they like, take their hand and shove it up in the-, the... I, I don't know. Um, but the ladies are gonna vote. At least one can do for them. Better late than never, wouldn't you say, Commander? We should talk to the dwarf, see how he thinks. There's no more expensive a commodity than a woman, Commander. And now you've increased their salaries as well. My stomach turns I did that a long time ago. The there were a lot of other things they had to go through before that. Catherine be damned. Give her a finger and she'll take the whole hand. Well, I got a finger to give her, God. All right. Commander. What? That? What? What? That was weird. <laughs> Want to give con insights about your colleagues? Anyone in specific? 
Tell me about Catherine. As true a lady as one of her species can get is Catherine. Tragic, really. She held sway over an entire kingdom, only to be drafted into the service of one who wouldn't have more than a flock of sheep under its command. If there weren't a wizard attesting, he's a very good boy indeed. I hear she hates men, or at least our male-dominated world, with a vengeance. In her land, women ruled and men served. Must have been a quaint locale indeed. What's his feelings on Hank? Anyone in specific? He is a bull that holds a general's rank, Commander. All balls and no brains, I dare say. But one can't deny the efficacy of his methods. I'm told he wasn't always given to such impetuousness in his actions. But with the coming of that prosthetic arm of his, came a change of character too. So, the Hank we know is recent. I'd conclude there's more to him than anyone in specific. What about Scarlet? She's no more than a tomboy playing a soldier. I don't know much about her, but I don't like what I've seen so far. We lizards have senses far superior to humans, and I rather resent having to continuously smell her in heat. Oh my. Suck it up, buddy. Hey, Hank. Yes, Commander. Alright, I don't think you have anything to say. Okay, um, with that, let's take a look at our research. Might as well spend it if we're taking M territory, right? Indeed. I think we are going to go ahead and keep upgrading our grenadiers. Okay. Seems like a good choice for the time being. Yes. In addition to this, I think we can look at Devastators. Alright. Good for buildings. They're basically just siege units. Oh, okay. Hmm. Once again, I like passives. Yes. Hunters. I haven't fought, faced many air units yet, so I'm not. I'm still not ready. To commit to the... Yes. Yeah, so let's go ahead and take a look at some more dragons. So hopefully we'll start having some land fights soon. And then I will actually be able to. Let's see. It's an aura. We can increase our HP. That might not be a bad idea. Yeah, so once we actually get into a fight, we're gonna be a lot more punchy. Yes. And with that, let us return to the strategic view and see what we can do. Alrighty. Things are starting to get a little more stuffed up. So I know I want this transport to come home. Yes. We have another transport ready, which I believe this transport, there is currently an ironclad in the area. Yep. Can I even go across? No, it reduces my movement. Oh, because right. of the ironclad. Yes, in there. so I think we are going to go ahead and rebuild that small ironclad fleet. Okay. Which is going to be this entire turn, unfortunately. That's fine. However,. That being said, we at least do have a path to be able to get some units out of here. So he's going to load up these and come over here okay. to drop them off. Okay. So I can at least get some armor on the mainland. Yep. Uh, this transport is going to wait for the time being. All right. Uh, we don't currently have any cards. We will start generating more, by the way. Okay, good. We can destroy a parliament... Since red is kind of our biggest threat, does he have one? No. Doesn't look like it. Okay. We could push there. I don't really want to. He only has a trooper. Think we should go there? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and push into this territory just to okay. claim a little bit more. I know I'm getting a little overzealous with that. Uh, we have four troopers and a grenadier. We have four troopers here. I'm going to bring two of them back. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, all of that's going to stay. These are our defenses. We don't currently have any more gold, so I think that's all we're going to have. Okay. Let's see. Ah, that's the entrenchment levels. Okay. Okay. All right, and let's see what happens. I'm just going to skip through and see what we have. Okay. All right, battle-wise, we do have one battle taking place here. Okay, yeah, green's coming. That's going to be a slaughter. And there's going to be a naval battle here. Yep. Uh, red will win. Oh no! Green a one. transport beats a zeppelin. Good to know for the future. Good. I want to see uh, 
more damage done against the red. Yes. So we have that battle done. Mm -hmm. And finally, we have a land battle to fight. I think we're going to win. Yeah. Let's just do it. Okay. I was going to say, we should see some of our new like abilities and stuff. Yes. Yeah. So we have Rejuvenation equipped, Devastation has been equipped. We need Steel Scales. Mm -hmm. We have Charm. We have Acid Breath. We have Advance and Sabotage. Okay. I know Acid Breath is going to be the most used, so let's swap that out. Okay. Like so. Excellent. Let's see. I'm just going to call this the base loadout. Okay. Oh, that was... For that. Okay, there's our default. All right, I, I need to build back some uh, some rapport with the generals here. Indeed. So as we can see, we handily. It's an icy land. It is. We're gonna move all of the troopers up. Of course. In the meantime. They're behind you. What? Their, uh, their base is on the other direction. Their ba base is over here. Oh, okay. That's weird. It look On the map, it looks like it's... Not at all. Okay, so we'll build that. Uh, we'll go ahead and build a war factory here in a moment. Okay. Go! Okay, there's the war factory. Look at him go. Yes. Did he just say pay me in blood? Yes. Okay. Oh, so he's in. He's working with Corvos then. Listen, these guys are pretty metal. <laughs> Building another recruitment citadel. Hey! God, look at the difference between the uh, population you have and they have. Well, they invaded a territory that was kind of full of stuff. Yep. Okay, so that's wiped out. Let's go ahead and claim this one. Just blow this up real quick. Yep. All right. Now let's just wipe out what they have. So I'm not going to push any further in for the short term. Okay. Uh, because if they have any turrets, they'll blow me to hell. Right. So those are just troopers, right? Yep. We'll build a quick factory. Yeah. Also, I want to get my dragon in there. Of course. So this is, I'm just going to let these all build themselves up. In Sounds good. Yep. We got three recruitment areas, so I'm not too worried. Yeah. Well, considering they only have a single base. <laughs> they have a single base with a air turret, and they have a decent amount of troops in there. Yeah. But when you go in as a dragon. Yes. Let's see. I like how the buildings materialize. Oh, yeah, they just phase in. Yeah, it's really cool. Let's see, are there turret placements here? No, they don't even have turret placements. Claim. Very. Alright, so I... All what? of the hunters. Excuse me. Oh, bit of lag there. A little bit. I think we won. Probably. So we'll grab everybody, order the advancement. Whee. Who said you could have this building? Did it totally say you could have this building? Nope. She and I are going to have to have a talk. I didn't say it! Ah, I overheated. Nee. Nee. I think I can charm a turret. I don't know. I don't know. I charmed that one unit and it's going to get itself killed. You could sabotage it. I could. Actually, I don't think I can sabotage uh, turrets. Or at least not that one. I was going to say, I, th I feel like you've sabotaged turrets before. Well, we're going to find out soon enough. But we're just gonna blow it up. Okay. All right. F two. Everyone, go in there. You guys have this handled. I can only hope so. Yeah, they're fine. 
just in case. I mean, buying these don't doesn't actually like cost us anything, so. Right. Yeah, I think we got this. I yes, I think so as well. Quick and easy. Huzzah! Finally, victory! a bloody victory after all. Oh look, they were beating us. Nope. <laughs> that was me. That was me going in and just being like. Yep. That was not me beating the meat. We beat our dear sister. We did. We beat her about the face of violently. Undead women allowed to vote. Emperor sweeps aside centuries of sacred tradition. You're damn right I did. Emperor victorious as slow new day grips Rivalon. News day. News day grips Rivalon. Shrapnel shreds civilians. You have not one shred of evidence, the imps justify. Dragon to wear armor to battle. Fight in jeopardy, says Aviant Adept. Aviation Flight adept. is in jeopardy, said the Aviation Adept. I can't read. Shut up. <laughs> All right, dwarves are still low. Elves are not doing well. Uh, Undead's not doing well again. Of course they're not. Bring the population of a country down to zero. Jeez. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us, us on this finally somewhat successful turn. Yes. I have been the Alchemical Rabbit. And it's Benatoli. And we will see you next time. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.